What is up, Mass Mikes? It's Mass Mike 830 here, and welcome back to another awesome LEGO DC Super Villains Customs video. Alright, so in today's video, we're going to be creating General Zod from the DCEU. Alright, so without further ado, let's get to it. Alright, so first off, we're going to go into the customizer, and we're going to get started. Alright, so first off, we're going to go to randomize the custom character. We're going to go to appearance, head, head, and then head again. Choose custom. Yeah. He does not... Okay, so this is... I'm starting to create him in the very beginning of the movie. In the very beginning of the movie when, when he's still on Krypton. So it does not look like, the, like he has the goatee. Or, not the goatee, the, uh, the soul pack. Yet. Yet. But, so, we're going to use custom head 24. Actually, no, he looks a little bit younger. Custom head 28, I guess. <laughs> Go to facial decal color, make it black. Let's get out of here. Go to hair. Cues. Maybe comb over. Slick back, maybe? Yeah, slick back will work. And make it black. And his chest logo is going to be pretty, pretty difficult. Because I'm not too sure what to do with the chest logo. So first, we're going to... I'm... First, I'm going to go through here, see what we have in our arsenal. Oh, that could work. Yeah, that'll work. Yeah, for now, that'll work if we give him the epilot piece. Epilot, ep epilot piece. The epilot piece. Go to epilot piece. Or actually, wait. Sod? No. General Zod. Oh, actually, no. Go to epilet piece and make it black. Go to arms. Both arms and choose... Aries' arms in black. Go to capes. Choose this cape. Actually. We might have to use General Zod's piece. General Zod's torso piece. Actually, no. Let's give him the cape. <laughs> and wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Maybe Adam Strange? Yeah, that'll work. Because he's got, like, a detail details in his chin, too. So, I chose Adam Strange's headpiece. Go to hands. Both hands and choose black hands. Go to hips. Choose... Spectre, maybe? Make it black. 
because he has like a belt detail. He has a belt detail in his um on his hip piece. Actually, cyborg will, cyborg movie might work. Yeah, cyborg movie will work. Go to legs, both legs, and choose. We actually don't see him from the waist down, so I'm just going to choose what I would choose for him in the other suit. So, yeah, Volko and make them black. <laughs> and right now, he actually doesn't have any powers. He gets the powers when he gets to Earth, just like same as Superman. So if Superman were to stay on Krypt, so say that Superman, if Superman were to stay on Krypton, he wouldn't have those powers. The sun, the sun, the Earth's sun gave him, gave Superman his powers, and so, and it also gave General Zod his powers and General Zod's, uh, General Zod's soldiers, which I will also be creating soon, very soon. I'm pretty sure next week, as in soon. I'm pretty sure soon, as in next week soon. So. Uh, before, be sure to look forward to that, and let's keep going. So, choose for his next appearance. He wears his um. He wears the suit that we see him in, in um. When we first, when Superman first meets him. Give me a sec. Make, let me make sure that's the same suit. Yeah, it's the same suit I'm talking of. It's the same suit I'm thinking of. So, first off, we're gonna wanna choose... <laughs> custom Head 20... 34, sorry, 34. And it's kinda like a grayish type hair, type uh, beard. So we're gonna keep it that way. But the hair, we're gonna keep black. Actually, let me try something. Vixen. Actually, let's just keep um, Slick back. Or we could choose Spiky O2. Because it has kind of like spikes coming from down, from uh, his from his forehead, coming down from 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 his hair to his forehead. If you guys have seen the movie, you kind of know what I'm talking about. So, okay, next up is his armor. Okay, so we're gonna choose. Oh, that'll work? Yeah, that'll work. Maybe. Alright. So, we're gonna choose fur collar. But make it black. Or actually... No, wait, wait, wait. I know what I'm gonna choose. We're gonna choose... This sod and make it black. And for the legs, we're actually going to choose Vigilante's legs. And for the hip piece, we're going to want to choose Ooh. 
Rain, I guess? Rain, maybe? No. The Shade? No. Oh, Vigilante? Yes, absolutely. Okay. Vigilante. Vigilante's hit piece. And we're going to want to take out the weapons. And we're not starting with his um, abil abilities yet. And then now, now what we got to do is his breathing, is give him his breathing mask that all, that all of the, um, all of the, uh, all of his soldiers wear, um, like kind of when they land on Earth. When they land on Earth. Go to face scarf, make it black. <clears throat> Go to head. Facial decal color will be black. Wrinkle decal color will be black. And go over to custom head 41 and make it black. And we're going to choose helmets. Choose... The Flash's helmet piece. That actually looks pretty. Uh, that actually looks pretty accurate from what I see in the, from what I see in this picture that I'm looking at right now. That actually looks pretty accurate. And this is actually when he gets his powers. Okay. So. He gets his powers gradually, actually. So, we're gonna choose... Let me... I wanted to see what that looked like. General Zod's torso piece looked like. <gasps> From the game. Uh, we're gonna choose Mr. Freeze and make it black. Actually, Merc. Let's try Merc. No. has like an armor type suit. An armored type suit. Oh, Black Manta movie. Perfect. Wait, is it black? Yeah, it's black. It's kind of like a black, dark gray. Same thing, kind of. And now we're going to give him... We're going to start from scratch and start giving him his abilities and the more the more actually this is gonna be pretty fun because the more I create of this character the more costumes I create of this character the more abilities I'm going to use so this is gonna be super fun the more abilities I'm going to add because he doesn't just like he doesn't get his superpowers like all at once. He gets them simultaneously, one by one. So, he starts off with super strength. When he lifts, when he lifts, um, when he lifts, when he lifts that truck at, um, at Superman's childhood house, um, and then, and then, now, we are going to give him, and he kind of wears, he kind of wears the same thing in, um, <clears throat> in the flash so it's kind of like the same concept so um so we're gonna start next we're gonna next we're gonna take out his oh we need him we need his cape all right so let's give him a cape 
and make it black. <laughs> All right, so now we're going to be creating him in his attire after he takes his breathing, breathing mask off. Choose his skin color. Facial decal color will be dark gray. And the wrinkle decal color will be black. Oh, wait, no. Tan. All right, now let's take out his, take off his helmet. And choose slicked back hair and make it black. Next up, we're going to want to create. Next up, we're going to give him his x ray vision. So, detective mode, tap circle. And it's more of like a bright blue. A bright <coughs> Excuse me. And go to skills, choose x ray. Graffiti, no. Elimination, no. Not yet. All right. Next up, we're going to go to Okay. I'm pretty sure this is the next costume. Oh, oh, take off the cape. Cause the cape, cause the cape caught on fire and he had to take it off. I, I just watched, I just watched this movie a few days ago, so I kind of know what I'm talking about. So that is General Zod in his main uniform suit. All right, now, now we're gonna <coughs> we're gonna be creating General Zod in his final attire in the big battle between him and Superman when he takes off all of his uh, armor, and it's just his suit. All right, so. Go choose reins. Choose reins, torso piece. It kind of looks like him already, but we gotta, we gotta do a little bit more. We gotta help it out a little bit more. Choose. Rain's arm piece. Okay, here we go. Okay. So, next up, cues. Rain's hip piece. Go to legs, both legs, and choose. Actually, let's see what Rain's legs look like. Mm 
They actually look they actually look pretty accurate. Alright. So that is General Zod in his final attire. Now we're gonna give him all of his abilities. He has hyper jump. Flight, yes. Hold square is going to be a beam. Beam style. Beam origin, both eyes. Q's red. Choose Beam Style 04. Detective Mode. Hold Circle. Hold Circle is going to be a lunge attack when he rushes towards Superman to attack him. Grapple gun, no. Technology access, no. Acrobat, no. Wall climbing, yes. Smash walls, yes. Beam deflect, yes. Chlorokinesis, no. X-ray, yes. Goon command, absolutely, yes. Cracking, no. Graffiti, yes. Or, no. Illumination, yes. And hazard protection, yes. And stealth, yes. Alright, so, go to basic information, status, villain character, character name, General Zod. Capital G, lowercase e, n, e, r, a, l, space, capital Z, lowercase o, d. I'm super happy with how General, General Zod turned out. So, go to animation, choose strong, speed, normal, enchantress, uh, target, target logo is going to be Lex Luthor, actually, no, for the lunge attack, let's actually change that up a bit, and choose this one. Because he does do that, actually, in the movie, now that I remember. And finally, for the effects, no left-hand glow, glow, no right-hand glow. For the hidden pact, style 01. Make it black. Go to... Jump slam effects, style 02. Style 01, make it black. Alright, now we're gonna go out here into the um into the open world and see just what he can do. Alright, so that is um General Zod compared to Superman in his black suit. So it's kinda it's kind of uh, the same. It's kind of it kind of looks the same when you when you look at them, when you look that when you look at them and when you look at them back to back, they kind of look the same. So his jump slam effect, his I gave him hyper jump, flight, and I gave him his heat vision. And as you can see, he can't hurt Superman because Superman is invulnerable. I gave him his um, super speed lunge attack. And
I'm pretty sure that's it. And I gave him a detective mode. Alright. Finally. Next up. Finally, we're gonna go back inside and change his heart color. Wait, wait, wait. I'm glad I looked at this picture again. He's, his hands, his hands are exposed. So he doesn't have gloves on right now. At this point in the movie, he does not have gloves. <laughs> that looks much better. That looks, that actually looks, not that it didn't look like him before, but now it looks even more like him. Health icon will be black. Health type will be invulnerable. And that's it. There you go, guys. That's it for me, Mask Mikes. Have a great rest of the day. I'll see you guys next week. Bye.